What's up guys? It's another quick keto update. Um, today is Wednesday, December 12th at 6:40 a.m. Uh, I don't know if I ever I don't know if I've ever explained why I decided to do keto. Um, but when I went to my doctor, um, what I needed to get something. I forget what, but they did, you know, the full kind of um in processing where they do your vitals and all that stuff and he had told me that um for my age height and weight that um i was considered obese um that he didn't say that to me but that was on my record when i'm able to look it up online i'm like obese i know i was a little bit overweight but the definition of obesity you know is a significant amount of weight over your ideal body weight and I know I was heavy but I didn't consider myself obese so that was shocker number one um, shocker number two was he told me that um, I was borderline insulin um, I mean borderline diabetic and that really threw me for a loop I'm like man um, that's crazy I got to do something um, I started researching and uh, this keto diet kept popping up and I've never, I think I di tried the cabbage diet back in the day. It was horrible. It was disgusting. And needless to say, I didn't do it for but a couple of days and just kicked it. Um, so when I started this keto diet, um, you know, something new, something exciting. Your coworkers know that you're eating differently. And me, I was, you know, I'm all in. You know, whenever somebody brings something into the office, I'm eating it. I'm the first in line. But they noticed that I wasn't eating a lot of the pastries and the donuts because it's almost Christmas time. And one of the traditions in our office workplace is uh, people like to bring in something every day up, up until the day of Christmas, like donuts, pastries, um, sweets and treats and stuff like that. So they noticed I wasn't eating that stuff. And I, you know, I told a few people I'm on keto and this and that. And most of the comments were negative. Stereotypical, I guess ideas about what keto is and I just didn't I didn't respond I didn't you know when somebody feels so strongly about something that they themselves probably have never done then it's no use in arguing with them it's just their, it's their opinion everybody's got one so um my best argument is my weight loss and um as of today I've lost 9.4 pounds since I've started my keto on the 5th of December so that's 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 7 days I'm down 9.4 pounds it's ridiculous um what's funny is we have weights um like straps that we use with some of our patients and I found a 10 pound weight just to get a perspective of how much weight that really is 10 pounds is significant uh, 10 pounds off your body is less stress on your joints on your organs um, when I look at myself in the mirror I really don't see it because weight loss is sort of like evenly distributed um, so it's not like I'm losing five pounds in my face or five pounds in my belly it's just kind of evenly distributed so I really don't see it because I'm looking at myself every day uh, however two of my coworkers noticed it uh, earlier in the week um, one of them said I see it in your face I don't have a fat head <laughs> Uh, so, and my belly um, has always been kind of big, but the clothing that I wear kind of hit it, but that's gone down um, a little bit. But I did some measurements today like I did when I first started, and there was no significant changes. Um, my waist is the same at 45. My widest part of my belly stayed the same at 48 inches. However, the only change was I lost an inch in my chest, which was 50, and now it's 49. That may be to um, user error, I don't know, but the weight loss is still significant enough that I'll take it. So, people often say is while they're eating, they see me eating you know, my food is like, I can never do that, you know, and I don't have the willpower. And, and my thing is, I've eaten the way I've wanted to for the past December 18th will be 48 years, pretty much. Ate what I wanted to, um, consumed without any cares, not really taking any thoughts about nutrition or how it affects my body negatively. Um, so some of these people who may be um, having condescending comments about keto or um, have negative views on it, probably really never have tried to discipline themselves to the point where they're going to try some something and stick to it um it's easy to sit on the sidelines and throw stones at, at people but when you're actually in the game trying to do something positive um that's a whole different story and for me the testimony or the proof that's in the pudding is actually the weight loss that i've had so far so 9.4 pounds in a week is significant i know the majority of that was probably water weight but i'll take it um that just uh revitalized how i feel about this whole program and what i want to do moving forward um i'm trying to learn something new every day about this diet and how i can adjust and uh, some of the things that I've picked up so far is I've, I've got to increase my fat, which I've, I've been doing. Um, I just started taking my uh, probiotics. Um, that came in the mail uh, yesterday. My prebiotics will be here tomorrow. Um, so I've been 
starting that. And also, um, I've been drinking a lot, crazy tons of water. I go to the bathroom like every 15 minutes, but I don't care. But doing all that flushing, I need to replace my minerals and electrolytes. So uh, I had some Gatorade, which I've consumed, and I've got to get more of that. But so far, so good. My goal is that I want to get fat adapted, and I know each body is different, and there's different uh, thought processes on when that occurs. But my goal is to try and try and stay in ketosis until April. Yeah, I want to stay, and it's December now. I know it's going to be challenging because now it's the holidays, but um, I figure I'm going to, I, I don't want to slip, and I don't want to get out of ketosis no matter what. And I'm going to actually get my vitals checked today, and maybe within the next month or so get some uh, get a workup done. I've got one uh, pre, but now I want to get one post now that I'm actually in ketosis 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 however you pronounce it but um that's that i just want to get off my chest and um if you're thinking about it or if you're actually doing it um i'd love to hear from you it's a small community uh, i'm starting off i don't know nearly as much as i need to but i'm learning and from what i'm doing and um i've been doing my little um my little ketone uh test strips daily which i've been falling in at the high category usually between um 8.0 and 1.6 is where i'm at so um i don't know if you can see that too good but i'm usually right in between the darkest one and the second one down so right in between those two colors which i think is real good uh i'm only learning more so we'll go from there and uh until next time be blessed peace